Hello, I'm Carol Moore, the 13th president of Linden State College. As we celebrate our first hundred years, I would like to invite you to join me in paying homage to our past and those who built that past and look with me to the future by taking a new view of Linden with the Second Century Campaign. The Linden of today, which has grown gradually and naturally from its roots as a teacher education institution, is committed to student success and to helping each student achieve his or her full potential. Ninety percent of Linden students qualify for financial aid. These students graduate with an average debt load of almost $29,000. To help our students deal with these overwhelming financial pressures, the Second Century Campaign has made student scholarships a top priority. I'm actually going to be the first in my family to attend college, and I honestly never thought that was possible, considering that my parents have such a low income. And I tried Linden, and if it weren't for the scholarship support I've gotten from the college and from my home state, there's no way I'd be able to come here and be part of the community and be successful. You need to have an opportunity, a financial opportunity, and this campaign will afford many kids the chance to try college first in family, give them a chance to succeed, and, and not deny them the opportunity that I had because they can't afford it. Lifelong learning is essential for teaching faculty. A continuously better educated professor is a continuously more effective teacher. The stronger the Linden faculty become, the greater the learning experience for students. In the atmospheric science program, it's very important for us to have cutting edge equipment. We need to remain competitive with other schools, and we also want our students to use the same equipment they're going to use in their professional careers. I know my professors have the real-world, real-time occupational experience within their respective fields, and it allows them to truly embody the Linden motto, the experience makes the education. And no school from here to back home in Texas really offered me that choice. And I know here at Linden, I'm not learning Latin, I'm learning life. Because our students spend so much time in the schools with internships and student teaching, when openings come up in the schools, the students already have a relationship in the schools. And the schools tend to know our students, know the quality of our students, and employ our students. Linden aims to expand its enrollment to 1,600 students by 2013. High-quality, well-designed residential, academic, and athletic facilities are central to enrollment growth in a vibrant campus community. Even though I'm from St. Johnsbury, Vermont, uh, Linden State's in my backyard, but there was a lot about it that I hadn't discovered yet. So when I heard about the Music Business and Industry program, uh, I realized that was something I wanted to check into. Uh, when I got here for my first day of classes, uh, everyone made you feel really at home. We met here at Linden Teachers College in 1949 and have remained friends ever since. And the reason was we were in activities here at Linden in sports and government, student government, and stayed working in two different school systems together, been friends and helped each other. I guess uh, sometimes the help weren't quite that good, but okay. <laughs> As the most remote and rural part of Vermont, the Northeast Kingdom is also the most economically challenged region of the state. The Second Century Campaign will help Linden focus student career aspirations and faculty expertise in response to the region's business and community development needs. For some six savings bank values and support Linden State College for three basic reasons. First is the economic engine it provides through its jobs in the region. Second is the 
trained and educated workforce that we so desperately need. And third is the cultural aspect that enriches all of our lives. I came to Linden State in 1975 for my degree in recreation, never imagining at that point that Vermont is where I would remain for my career, my family, my home, and it's been a great experience. It's a great place to have raised a family, to educate a family. My daughter's an alum, and we all feel pride in being from the Linden State College community. My family and I believe Linden's very worthy of our support. My mom and grandmother were graduates of the normal school. My grandmother a graduate of the college. I'm a product of elementary schools in Caledonia County, probably all staffed with Linden graduates oh so long ago. The next century is just as important for other children, other families, and for the region. And we need Linden as a base as we go forward. This campaign will make it possible for students like me to be successful. That's what Linden State's all about. Thank you for joining us in celebrating Linda's past and taking a new view of Linda's future. The people you have seen and the stories you have heard today provide a glimpse into the lives that Linden has transformed in its first 100 years, as well as a hint of opportunities awaiting Linden students in the Northeast Kingdom over its next 100 years. As you take a new view of Linden, please consider making a gift to the Second Century Campaign. This is a wonderful opportunity for you to make a huge impact on future generations of Linden students in the very special place we call the Northeast Kingdom. For more information about the Second Century Campaign, visit www.lindenstate.edu forward slash a new view.